everyone, I'm Atarva. I'm a third year student in the Van Lang Group. I'm going to show you my office, so let's go. Wow, look at that view. So this is our office, and unlike the Zawada group, we take the entrance that is closest to our office. So let's go in. Hey, Jonathan, what are you doing here in the middle of the pandemic? Uh, hey, I'm Jonathan. I'm a fourth year in the Van Lang group, and this is our office working space. Here we have a window, which is the highlight of this room. Not everybody gets a window, but we do. Um, and so it's got a very nice view of Union South over there, and you can definitely see when it snows, which is really nice. If you come on over here, also have our community fridge which may or may not have moly spaghetti in it right now it does not so that's good and uh, this is also where we keep our snacks for the uh, for the group Atarva <laughs> yeah yeah Jonathan what are we saying aren't you gonna tell us about the group culture oh yeah sure the group environment is fun, collaborative, collegial. These are some uh, adjectives that people have used to describe uh, how working in this group is. Uh, I think all of us enjoy spending time together in this office, so there is a lot of crosstalk, a lot of chit-chat about things that are not necessarily work-related, and there's obviously a lot of work-related talk where everyone helps each other with their codes, their uh, doubts, or anything that can require any help. Uh, about uh, Reed, Reed is an amazing advisor and uh, as Samartha uh, told us, Reed is a very fun guy to work with because he is um, very nice to you, he is also very organized, so it makes him a great advisor in general. Okay, Jonathan, so one thing we get asked frequently is what do we do all day? Like what does a daily day in the life of a grad student who does computational work look like other than drinking soda as you can see? So can you walk us through what you do on a regular basis? Sure thing. Yeah, so this all starts by finding out how to initialize some simulations. And that we do using bash scripts. So we code and I use Visual Studio code to write some scripts. And then I can submit those scripts on the terminal uh, into our supercomputer that we have on campus. And then once those are finished running, I go on Visual Molecular Dynamics and go visualize the simulations to make sure everything looks good. And then once I'm finished with all that, I'll go into Python and I'll me make measurements on my simulation and perform some analysis on those simulations. Okay, that sounds interesting. Can you uh, tell me what other stuff you do other than just maybe running simulations? Okay, sure thing. Um, you know, we read a lot of papers, so this uh, paper on learning spatial control features and 3D CNNs is totally relevant to my research. I'm also uh, grading papers. Um, we also attend seminars and sometimes give seminars, we have group meetings, and um, we find snacks around campus. Oh, that's an interesting point. Do you find free snacks on campus? Does Reed treat you to free food frequently? Oh yeah, I'd, I'd probably say, you know, upwards of once a month. And during group meetings, we usually get some snacks uh, during group meetings. Oh, that sounds like the best group ever. It, it's a pretty sweet group, I'd have to say so. Thank you for your interest in the Van Lang Group, and thank you for watching this video. If you'd like to learn more about our group, please visit our group website posted here. Thank you.